Have you ever wondered why the Amazon River is considered dangerous? This question might have crossed your mind, especially if you're a fan of exploration, adventure, or simply nature's wonders. Let's embark on a journey to unravel the intricacies of this marvel of nature. The Amazon River, an astonishing natural wonder, courses its way through South America, traversing nine countries, including Brazil, Peru, and Colombia. With a length of approximately 4,000 miles, it is second only to the Nile in terms of length, but holds the title for the world's largest river by discharge of water volume. The Amazon River is not just a geographical entity, it is a lifeline, an ecosystem, and a bustling hub of biodiversity. Its discovery dates back to the mid-16th century, when Spanish explorer Francisco de Orellana voyaged its entire length. This expedition unveiled a world of unseen flora and fauna, and the river has been a subject of continual exploration and fascination ever since. The Amazon River's significance extends beyond its sheer size. It plays an instrumental role in our planet's health, acting as a natural sink for carbon dioxide, one of the greenhouse gases responsible for global warming. Additionally, it is home to a staggering variety of wildlife, with species that are yet to be discovered by science. The discovery of the Amazon River dates back to the 16th century. In the year 1541, a daring Spanish explorer by the name of Francisco de Orellana embarked on a journey that would lead him to one of the world's most majestic and mysterious bodies of water. Orellana, a man known for his courage and resolve, set out with an expedition party, their hearts filled with anticipation and their minds brimming with curiosity. It was a journey that would take them deep into the heart of South America, into a world untouched by the hands of man, a world we now know as the Amazon rainforest. The expedition was fraught with peril. The men faced a multitude of challenges, each one more daunting than the last. Navigating the massive river was a task in itself. The Amazon River, with its winding course and powerful currents, proved to be an unpredictable and formidable adversary. The river's sheer size was staggering. Spanning over 2,000 miles it was a titan among rivers, a force of nature in its purest form. But the size of the river was not the only challenge. The explorer and his crew faced a variety of dangerous creatures, unseen diseases, and the harsh realities of survival in an untamed environment. The relentless torrential downpours, the oppressive heat, and the constant threat of starvation were daily reminders of the river's dangerous nature. Yet, Orellana and his men pressed on, driven by the spirit of exploration and the promise of discovery. In the end, their perseverance paid off. They had discovered the Amazon River, a river that would go on to captivate the imagination of generations to come. Danger lurks beneath the serene surface of the Amazon River. As tranquil as the river may appear, it's a deceptive facade hiding a world of unseen threats. You see the Amazon isn't just the world's largest river by volume, it's also one of the most perilous. Let's start with the river's unpredictable currents. These aren't your typical gentle river flows. The Amazon's currents are volatile, shifting in a heartbeat, and can pull the unsuspecting beneath its surface in an instant. Even the most experienced swimmers can find themselves at the mercy of these invisible forces. Then there's the river's infamous aquatic life. Yes, we're talking about the piranhas and anacondas. Contrary to popular belief, piranhas aren't always the bloodthirsty creatures Hollywood makes them out to be. But make no mistake, in the right conditions, they can be just as dangerous. These razor-toothed fish are known to attack in packs, especially when food is scarce or they're provoked. As for anacondas, these are the Amazon's silent assassins. They lurk in the murky river waters, their camouflaged bodies almost indistinguishable from the debris and vegetation. These formidable serpents can grow up to 29 feet long and are more than capable of overpowering a human. And if the currents and critters weren't enough, there's another invisible threat in the Amazon River, disease-causing parasites. The river's warm waters are a breeding ground for these microorganisms. One such example is the candiru, a parasitic catfish known to invade the urethra of unsuspecting swimmers. Another is the schistosoma, a flatworm causing the disease schistosomiasis, which affects millions of people worldwide every year. So the serene surface of the Amazon River is a deceptive mirage. Below it, a world of hidden perils thrives. From unpredictable currents and dangerous aquatic life to microscopic parasites, but the dangers of the Amazon River don't stop at its waters. The Amazon rainforest, home to the river, is a world of its own dangers. Imagine a realm where every leaf, 
every twig and every creature can pose a threat. The Amazon rainforest is that place. It's a lush green world teeming with life, but within its heart lie dangers that can challenge even the most seasoned adventurers. Let's begin with the flora. The rainforest is a botanical wonderland, but not all plants play nice. Some, like the manchineel tree, are so poisonous that merely standing under it during rainfall can cause severe skin irritation. Others, like the strangler fig, can grow around and suffocate other trees demonstrating the relentless struggle for survival within the forest. The rainforest is also a haven for a myriad of insects, many of which are venomous. The bullet ant, for example, is known for its extraordinarily painful sting, likened to being shot. Mosquitoes, too, are a constant threat carrying diseases such as malaria and dengue fever. Then there's the wildlife. The Amazon rainforest is home to some of the world's most dangerous animals. Jaguars, the largest cats in the Americas, roam the forest, as do deadly reptiles like the green anaconda and the poison dart frog, a tiny creature with enough toxin to take down 20 grown men. And let's not forget about the forest itself. Its dense vegetation and confusing topography can easily lead to disorientation and getting lost. Without proper navigation skills, one can wander aimlessly for days, facing dehydration, starvation, and the constant threat of the unknown. But here's a sobering truth. Despite all these hazards, the most significant threat to the Amazon River and its surroundings is not its venomous insects, deadly animals, or poisonous plants. It's not even the risk of getting lost in its vastness. Yet, the biggest danger of the Amazon River is arguably the one posed by humans. The Amazon River is under threat, and the danger is us. This stark reality is one we must face head on. Our actions as a species are impacting this remarkable river system in ways we're only beginning to understand. Deforestation, a human-driven activity, is a significant threat to the Amazon. As we clear massive swaths of forest for agriculture, logging and urbanization, we're depriving the river of its natural safeguards. These forests are the river's lifeblood, absorbing rainwater and releasing it slowly into the river system. Without them, the river is vulnerable to devastating floods and severe droughts. Pollution too is a destructive force. Industrial waste, agricultural runoff, and untreated sewage are pouring into the Amazon, contaminating its waters and threatening the myriad species that call it home. From the smallest microorganisms to the largest river-dwelling creatures, every life form is at risk. And then there's the specter of climate change. Rising global temperatures are disrupting weather patterns leading to increased frequency and intensity of storms and droughts. These climatic shifts pose a serious threat to the river's ecosystem and the biodiversity it supports. But the impact doesn't stop at the river's edge. The Amazon River is the life source for millions of people, providing water for drinking, irrigation, and industry. The health of the river directly impacts the health of these communities. Moreover, the Amazon plays a crucial role in regulating the world's climate by absorbing carbon dioxide. Damage to the Amazon River therefore has global repercussions. In conclusion, the dangers the Amazon River faces are not just inherent to its environment, but are significantly amplified by human activities. We, as the culprits, have the power and the responsibility to mitigate these threats. By understanding and respecting the Amazon's intricate web of life, we can ensure its survival, and ours. So the Amazon River, a symbol of nature's beauty and power, is also a stark reminder of the dangers hidden within and the threats we pose to our environment.